You hate to get off to a slow start. It takes so long to dig yourself out of the hole. On the other side of the coin, if you have a great start like the Phillies have this year, you can live off of that for at least half of the year. So, no, the Mets are not out of it by any means, but they were, they're going to have to start playing and playing well. Bob, can I do my Bob Murphy imitation for you? Yeah, you go right ahead. Take the field as we get underway. Here's my colleague and friend, Ralph Kiner. <laughs> Hi again, Mets fans. It's opening day. He pops the ball up, drifting out of play. Ambling over. Oh, what a play. Here's my colleague and friend, Lucy Nelson. I'd be chilling with my bad soul. Hey, I can get down. confines of Wrigley Field, as the Mets will be playing the Chicago Cubs. Skies are blue, just a few clouds in the foreground. All in all, it's just a perfect day for baseball. It will be a battle of young veteran South Walk. The portly left-hander Mickey Lulich goes to the hill for New York. He'll be opposed by young Daryl Knowles for Chicago. Today's game is brought to you by Manufacturers at Oak. That manufacturer's hat over is thank you the way you want it to be. And by Chicago's Frank. A Frank by any other name could never ever taste the same. Right, Marvin? We'll be back with my fellow colleague and friend, Mr. Steve Zabriskie, right after these messages. You've got it down pretty good, I would think. <laughs> I've had a lot of practice, Bob. <laughs> well, it was nice of you to. They always say that flattery is a. If they imitate, imitation imitation yeah. is a form of flattery, and I certainly accept it as that. And uh, I wish you well. Good luck to you. 